This is a very small flapjack plant, but she's putting out lots of pups, which is what they normally do. And you can take the pups off while they're little and start new plants. And this is a nice size one. Um, uh, you can see the size of this, this little one here. This is an area where I have more of the uh, flapjack plants. This particular ty type in the sun um, gets red. There were some flapjacks that even in the sun they stay green. I like this one. Some weeds to take out here too. You can see the size. They're a nice size. This is another group of uh, flapjack plants. And uh, you can see the size of these right here. This beautiful flapjack is one of the largest I have ever grown. In the sun, they get um, some red on them. This one's in mostly shade, and so she has a lot more green on her, but she's just huge. Uh, you can see from the size of my foot how huge this one is. It's right alongside. She's not in bloom right now, but uh, she'll have purple blooms. It's a beautiful native grass, muley grass, and I've got about I don't know, 12 muley grass in this bed. And uh, this collage is just so healthy and beautiful and putting out babies. This flapjack is obviously in bloom. She's going to leave me soon, but she's. I've harvested probably 15 uh, pups from her, and there's more there now. Every time I take a few out, she replaces them. But I've got two in bloom. This one's kind of large. If you're wondering what kind of bamboo that is in the back, that's Buddha belly bamboo. But this flapjack is about to flower. And I've had her three years uh, in the container. I have another one that is blooming, but she's much smaller. And uh, she's over here by the mailbox. You can see she's a much smaller and that's one of the pups I took off the other plant uh, this one's flowering too but she's got pups on the other side you can see her pups down low there so there'll be more to replace her sorry to see her go this is my other little rock garden here that's blew my mind and a desert rose and some new blew my mind I took the purslane out after a year, it looked ratty, and I cut it back, and it, you know, one year of purslane, and she's tough to bring back to the same condition. So I put in three more, blew my minds uh, yesterday, and, uh, but the desert road's doing great.